What's up guys? Welcome back. This is Nick up here at Maple Motors in Hendersonville, Tennessee. And today we're about to go for a test drive in a 1963 Impala. This one's sitting on the air ride suspension. We'll be testing that out through the ride. It does have a date code correct, 327 under the hood. Cammed up. Some nice exhaust on this one. I just got done doing an outside walk around, pointing out any kind of flaws I could find. Definitely check out my website, maplemotors.com. We get cars like this in every day. And we just updated yesterday. We update every Monday. Hood shuts down nice on this one. We're about to hop in her and find out how she rides. Y'all ready? It's that time. Test drive time. Before we take off, gonna look around the interior on this car. Kind of check everything out. I like the color scheme. Looks good in here. Headliner's in great shape. Guys, if you check out maplemotors.com, you can get financing information, wheels, tires, parts, accessories. They also ship these cars all around the country. We'll start it up here. Got a good sound. We got the motor warmed up right at 190 right now. Full pressure's jumping up to 50 and it comes down below 20 right at 20 it is idle pretty low I like six seven hundred rpms right now it is showing eighty thousand miles on the dash gas gauge is right at a quarter tank try our wipers out wipers work hit our radio radio works horn no horn on this one our air ride sitting right in the middle here we got it at right at 100, should be a smooth ride. Our fan, can't get our blower motor to kick on. We do have an AC compressor that's in a toad in the trunk, so that'll go with the car. All right, guys, let's take off down the road. All right, guys, getting ready to take off. Put my seatbelt on here. Got my vent window open. It's the best AC when you don't have AC, so. This is actually the first time I've driven this car. Anything that I see that may be wrong, I will let you know. Speedometer's coming up. Car's going straight down the road. It's not pulling to the left or right. Steering's nice and tight. As soon as I turn, it turns. See if the kick down is hooked up here. Kick down is hooked up. Bar pull is pretty good. The suspension feels great with this air ride. Let's try our brakes before we get too close here. Brakes are stopping fast. so good I love the way it feels going down the road smooth steering side brakes feel good and the kick downs hooked up only thing this car needs is the, the horn hooked up well I need the horn right now because this guy's sitting in a green light turn signals out you have to hold it up the turn signal doesn't feel quite right it's not clicking up holding itself so you got to hold it yourself but it is popping up on the dash there we'll try the other side when I get on this back road here I got to make a left turn up here anyways
Temperature gauge is staying right at 190. Oil pressure gauge is at 30 while we're driving down the road. I notice it does drop below 25 at an idle. It could be because the idle's so low on this car. Left turn signal's the same way. You gotta hold it down to keep it clicking. I'm gonna get over here and get some outside shots. I'm gonna drive by the camera, let you hear what the car sounds like. And we'll continue this test drive. See the cars all the way down on the ground. All right, got y'all on the virtual cam here. You can see you're all set up there. We gotta raise this car back up and I think to do so you just push some buttons you see the gauge coming up that is the front end coming up I'm gonna get it to about a hundred and then I'm gonna do the back that's the best ride I could get out of it so far come up pretty quick especially when your tanks are full Good to go now. Cool. I'll try not to turn my head too much. It's one of the common mistakes that I make while y'all while I got y'all on the head cam. turning my head everywhere but I gotta make sure I don't pull out in front of nobody too so and there's lots of traffic right now so it's just perfect go ahead and go Car's running nice and smooth. Didn't notice the water temperature got up to about 200 in the parking lot, maybe 205, not much more than that. I was doing a lot of circling around, a lot of getting on it a little bit, trying to pass the camera. 
but it's immediately back down to 190 as soon as we took off. It is a hot summer day. It's almost about 90 degrees here. bump in this road up here we're gonna hit it it's pretty much a speed bump but with this air ride it's nice and smooth it's coming up right here in the road can't get much better than that out for some of this traffic here. Guys, let me know if y'all like this new head cam thing I'm doing. Or if y'all just want to be back in the window. Pull into the lot here. I do like your feedback. It helps me improve these videos. So We're going to be doing some more today too. I got a Camaro I'm getting ready to get to. All right. Alright guys, I do appreciate y'all watching. If you don't mind, hit up maplemotors.com. I got finance options. You can also ship this car anywhere in the country. You can get close to 100 detailed pictures at that website as well as wheels, tires, parts, and accessories. If you enjoyed this video, go check out the walk around video. I do videos of every single car on this car lot as well. I just did one this morning showing off all 15 new cars we updated Monday. Every car gets two videos, they're easy to look up. For example, this is a 1963 Impala. Put 1963 Impala in the YouTube search bar along with Maple Motors and you'll find both videos. One's a detailed description pointing out any kind of flaws on the outside and one's a test drive. Help us out by sharing our videos. That's one of the best things you can do for this channel. Hit that subscribe button and the notification bell and you can see posts every single day. Appreciate y'all watching. Thanks again, guys.